Hey guys, in this video, I'm just going to show you how I was able to integrate your CRT into EVE. So I have a step-by-step step, step, by step procedure here. And the prerequisite for you to use Secure CRT in, inside EVNG is to have Secure CRT installed on your laptop. You can also use uh, PuTTY, the default is PuTTY, but I wanted to use uh, Secure CRT, so I wanted to, I mean, I uh, searched about it. So step one is you have to install the Windows client pack, Windows client side pack from the from the Eve NG website. And this is the link, this is the link here. And I, I have it open here actually. This is the link. And if you go down, or actually it's here, the button here, just click on it. And this is the Windows client side that you have to install. It says here below one below one can find a Windows client si side pack that will install everything in ASRA for running Telnet, VNC, Wireshark, RDP applications when working on or building labs on EVNG. EVNG. It includes all all of these uh, features or installers. So it says it will modify Windows registry files for proper for it to properly work. It will save all the files on the local PC if one would like to modify, for example, using secure CRT instead of, yeah. So that's why, that's what I'm doing here. Mod I'm using uh, secure CRT instead of PuTTY. So Windows 8 and 10 to support tab, yeah, okay. All right, so next step is Once, so yeah, I, I went ahead and download this. I think I downloaded this one. Yeah. I went ahead and downloaded, downloaded it. And once installed, I just have to go to the Eve NG folder. Uh, and in my example, this is where, uh, if, this is where the Eve NG folder is located, so it should be here. And next is you have to double click on this here. Double click on it. Yes. Just click yes and OK. And then go to search bar and type default apps. Default apps there. And then, so what I'm doing here is basically I'm changing the default app uh, for the SSH Telnet and our login client. Because uh, it might be that, as I mean, PuTTY is the default app to use. So I'm going to, so in, in my case, uh, secure CRT is already selected because I already did this uh, before making this video, but I'm just going to do it again. So set, I mean set default. I mean select secure CRT application set default, and then next log into EvenG and choose native console. I have EvenG open here, so I'm going to log in and I will select native console, sign in, and I have a lab here, open. And then now you should be able to use your CRT. So let me try that. I'm going to start all of the devices that I have in this topology. So yeah, so going back here, I just I'm don't exactly remember is uh, the link, but uh, I think, yeah, this is the one that I, yeah, I remember now. This is the one that I downloaded, uh, just in case you wanted to, never tried to open this one actually. Ah, this is one in, okay, yeah, same. Uh, you can either choose this one, this downloader, or 
this file or this file doesn't matter all right so going back let me see if where's my lab let me see if I can now console into the devices so console to all nodes actually I can double click on it yeah double click on it yeah so now I'm using SSH I mean uh, secure CRT uh, to <coughs> to access switch one and the router as well so yeah that's how you can integrate secure CRT into Eve into Eve and G and if you find this video uh, helpful uh, please don't forget to hit like share and subscribe and I'll see you on the next one. Bye.